hey what's up everybody welcome back to my channel i have the coolest collection to show you so let's go ahead and get straight into it so today's video is going to be with profusion cosmetics and i have some great pieces to show you and if you would like to get these i'll be sure to link them down in the comments down below when i tell you everything here can literally be fine in walmart and you can also go on their website as well it's under the peanuts collection um when i tell you this whole thing just had me like giddy and so nostalgic for one it's charlie brown come on now but one thing about it whenever i use profusion cosmetics i'm never let down because it is the color cosmetics brand when it comes to pigmentation and quality it's literally the best and as you can see with the prices everything is doable i think my favorite thing honestly about this whole collection too is that with every piece in this collection it comes with a collectible item specifically a pin and they're of each of the characters in charlie brown so if you are wanting to get these pins which i will be showing you guys shortly you have to get this specific collection and honestly i think this collection was originally 120 but they dropped it down to 108 and you get everything in here that you see or you can get it individually and these here are the exact pins that i was talking about you collect 10 of these things and you can either put them on your crocs or a hat or a shirt or scarf or whatever you have but i think they're the cutest thing so if you're interested i will be sure to drop both profusion cosmetics website and where you can find them in walmart as well like aren't these pins just the cutest honestly because all my crocs lost their pins i think i'm just gonna go ahead and i'm gonna put them on my crocs especially for this october season it's halloween season so what better time to actually give you guys a profusion and peanuts halloween collection vibe slash makeup tutorial with this like all of these products will be used in this video so like i said i'll be linking them but those pins i'm definitely going to use them on my crocs but let's go ahead and get straight into this video so starting off i'll be using the apple bobbing overnight lip mask i really 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 like this lip mask it actually retails for about nine dollars on the profusion cosmetics website and it smelled like caramel apples and i really like that it wasn't like too thick or too heavy it just really felt like a lip mask that would actually work i was actually obsessed with it, it smells so good then i'm going in with the illuminating face primer and i actually like this one too because it actually gave an illuminating glow it just didn't feel thin it didn't feel like i was just wiping a whole bunch of glitter on my face this primer felt so good i felt like i could just have a natural look and just go out so both of these things so far i would give them an eight out of ten both of these fire you see that glow look at that and now I um, actually did my brows and stuff off camera because I didn't feel like I needed to show you guys that. That was just extra stuff. So I'm going in with the eyeshadow palette, the Trick or Treat eyeshadow palette, which retails for about $18. And look at that yellow. So, you know, out of anything, like yellows and sometimes pinks are really, really difficult when it comes to showing up whenever doing eyeshadow. But this is why I love Profusion Cosmetics because they do not skim on the pigment. The pigment always goes crazy. I've never had a palette from Profusion Cosmetics that did not deliver it exactly what I wanted out of it. And this palette just gave me like the vibes. And honestly, looking at the eyeshadow palette, it gave off like candy corn vibes. So that's kind of what I was going for here. I really wanted to incorporate fall colors, but with some inspiration from the palette. So I'm doing kind of like a candy corn inspired theme with this eyeshadow palette. Again, if you are interested in any of Profusion Cosmetics products, I will say you can find it either on their website or you can actually go into Walmart. Most of the time, Walmart always has Profusion Cosmetics stuff from their brushes to their sponges to eyeshadow palettes, lippies, blushes, whatever you need, they normally have it in store. So if you're not wanting to wait for delivery, you can go into Walmart and find it. Now, specifically about this collection, I'm not sure if they have it in store. However, I know when I previously got something from profusion cosmetics this was another specific collection that is it was in store so i'm assuming that this one is too but if it is i will link it down in the description if not you could just go on their website and i will actually put that somewhere up on the screen where you can go into their website and go into their specific collection and find this exact collaboration
now that I got my eyes together and as you can see everything came out beautifully even like this foil color they have like this rose gold foil color that I'm using on my lid it looks so 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 pretty I was obsessed with that um I'm gonna go ahead and I'm going to do my base routine I'm kind of just gonna zoom through that I'm really not gonna talk to this because that's not the point of this video so you could just sit back and chill and watch me do my base routine So now that I have my powders on, I'm actually going to go in with the illuminating setting spray and I'm going to spray that all over my face and then take my foundation brush 
and I'm going to press that into my skin so that way we can set this makeup. Normally I use a matte setting spray, but this is not the case. This is meant to illuminate and you're definitely gonna need it for these fall months, even the cold months, because you know, things can get a little dull. And I really like the fact that this setting spray, it just like, look look at look at the makeup, like look at it. Like it didn't flatten anything out. It didn't make anything look oily. Like this literally gave it a shine that I was so obsessed with. So I'm gonna spray my face and then we're gonna move on to the next thing. So I don't typically use highlighter in my makeup, but honestly I had to with this one because it was so pretty. You see that purple color? This is the holographic highlighter that goes for about $8. And I was so obsessed with this look. Like I was a little worried that it was gonna be ashy because you know, sometimes highlighters like these look a little ashy for black girls, but no, honestly it gave a really, really pretty glow. And I was using a highlighter like, we need to start doing that more often. We need to bring back like the colored looks and the, like the full glam looks, the highlighters and all the, colorful eyeshadow looks and just outrageous looks like i really really like this highlighter you can see i even put it on the bridge of my nose like i should have put it under my brow you know that's an og staple piece whenever you're doing your makeup now i'm gonna go in with the rhinestones and and put those like on the outer corner of my eye i didn't really have like a specific thing that i was going for i kind of just wanted to place them somewhere i wanted to use them because i mean they were given to me so why not so I'm gonna place like three on the outer corners of my eye and I'm gonna place two big ones on the inner corner just for a little razzle dazzle. So now to finish off my lips, I'm actually gonna put one of the chrome liquid toppers on. It actually comes in a set, it retails for about $12, and I'm gonna put that on my lips. I like the way it changed my lipstick. It made it look like I already had on gloss, and I didn't, and that's just because it was already shiny. But because I'm a gloss girl, I had to put some on, and it really brought this look together. Like, I had so much fun creating this look. It was so pretty, so vibrant, and it just came out like amazing so if you guys have any requests for this month please let me know down in the comments because i've already have four and i plan on doing 15 of them so let me know what kind of looks you guys want to see for this halloween season and i'll be sure to deliver thank you guys so much for tuning in and i will see you guys in the next video bye